call. Spins, he loves that move. What a pass for Steve Zimmerman. Taj call. that is brilliant. Wow. He sees Zimmerman underneath. Spins, draws Magnate and finds Zimmerman. Start with some authority and it's Isaac Humphreys who fires unsuccessfully. Quickly up the floor, here's Zimmerman from close range. So Adelaide... Four unanswered points to take the lead for the first time. Here's McCall slicing his way inside and coming up with the excellent. Off the left, takes a little bounce into the middle of the key. They haven't really got anything here to tie pants. Now it's Joe Wise He's just re-entered the game. Draws a double team, kicks it out to McCall straight on three. So those ones that are just intercepted passes are so often just lazy passes. Not something different. They're actually the second hardest team to score on in the league. It's 78 points per game, which is outstanding. And outstanding is that man. Deng there with the offhand and helps himself to two more. I mean, that's a talented player. Nice left hand finish. Oh, of eight from long range last week. Early knockdown today. Dane Patterson shut down. McCall, quick outlet pass. Smart type of ball. Whoa, he's still alive. Deng. Put Sam Froling in the bucket and cuts this thing to four. Difference maker. First look at Tajir McCall. He's such an addition to the Hungry Jacks NBL. He can get it done in so many ways. This is tough. Right in the shot clock now for Kent. Gonna have to put it up. Three left, two left from three. All part of the ground. People might think he's a lot of work going in your area. There he is, one on the shot clock, up and under scores. Looking at this, and yeah, on the offensive end, the couple of turn up, he'll spin, try and get to the rim. He's just like, please, body hold up. So this is what Keanu Pinder can do. Go out there, just play with the energy. That is an absolute gift. Oh. Deng, quickly down the floor. Dotting under oh. the ball, was that? Oh my goodness, that's out of this world! Oh, he saw it coming. Just a look away, but instead threw it so far back that Winder just had to lay it in. Oh, look at it again from this angle. Beautiful no look. Machado, single figure shot clock now. Someone's going to have to let it go. McCall the man, and Magic McCall fills it again. I've lost to McCall. But Pinder ahead. Looks it back. Bull Cole. Yeah. Oh, they're firing. But this whole quarter has been coming down to who's playing smart. Good smart play. Right. Six see it. minutes for the bullets. We call great pass inside the pin and the shot clock, which has been happening all too much in this quarter in the single figures for the tight fans. McCall has to let it fly. 25 footer rattles at home. Yeah. We are set to go. Far off Queensland. It's Friday night hoops here at the Hungry Jacks at NBL the Cats tight bands. Working to the left of your screen. Oh, oh. Tim and the dunk inside six seconds. How about that? But this is the quickest, nicest. Ooh, with Josh Adams going out now, I mean, a bit more scoring and creativity. And the call at the other end. And in transition, he is tough. Big Nate going to work once more. They send the double team and look at the ball movement. Crisp around to McCall, who takes on Peakling, draws constant system. And I love the way they used to run the flex action movement, but they had a lot of counters as yes. well. As soon as he was denied, there was back doors everywhere. Everyone knew exactly what was going to happen. So that man will. Up to 19 points, six of nine from the field. I think he wants to pilot that bandwagon the way it's going at the moment. McCall. Turns inside. Can he get the start? He's after. You bet he can. The defeat. And swiped away by Tajima. They were in the drought. Great anticipation. And McCall for a bit of showtime. Throws down another two for the top. 42. Four cans. Here we go, McCall. Six more to go. Built this culture. Look, they embraced Tazzy. Tazzy embraced them straight back. And that's what the nest has built. Oh There's a snapshot of how Cairns oh are going to play this season. Careless yeah, turnover, but it's design that we saw last year. Great pass, great finish. From the Phoenix perspective, Screeny, you're all over it. Great starting this one on the bench. Two thousand. Look at McCall. Dances into the paint and puts a lid on two. With that <laughs> slam dunk. Getting past Adam and just throwing it down. What an arm
Castle from John Kane Arena. Most of our double header tonight. Perth and Illawarra to come a little later. And inside, and the finish comes Did he Kane. mean that? Did he mean to make that pass? Well, Lack may one of their injured players at the moment. Lack, thanks very much for joining us. Jumps out. Three seconds for Cairns. McCall from halfway. Got it! Staying in touching distance at the moment. The Taipans keeping themselves right in it. They force a turnover as well. McCall the other way. Takes it all the way. Dribble. McCall, not a lot of time for him to work from. So he fires from deep. McCall, two on the shot clock. Needs to get busy. Forced into a tough oh, one right. and gets a user-friendly roll with the shot clock going off in the background. Seven points. I like they went to DJ Hogan. This is well defended from Michael Frazier. Jim McCall is just together. Both have the ability to step out and knock down the three. Rolling shows there. Oh, he, he missed the first one, made the second, and and, uh, and won some money, but Jeez, they're not 50k. That is a good effort. Someone filmed it, he might be able to double up, especially in the opening quarter. Oh, spinning into a traffic. Baseline McCall for the finishing touches. He's got 13. If you're perfect, you're thinking we still got our ace in the hole, who hasn't even got that involved yet, and we still got a 16 point lead. From the front. Lead from long range. That's not what they would have been looking for. McCall. He's got time to get this away. Got it! At the halftime buzzer to Shea McCall launches. Clock had really good awareness and then got that thing in stride. It's caught not so Adelaide back-to-back -back baskets here. Take a three-point lead. McCall oh, lob pass. Wardenberg was inventive and off the mark. Scott, quick outlet oh. pass. He's got McCall hovering. That's caught. 12 unanswered points here to take. We've got to run back and help each other out. I'm on, I'm on Gary Brown watch throughout Dunky Larry when he comes back. Yeah. You know what? I like to see him throw it back out to a guard, relocate, try and seal. Because if he catches it anywhere towards the key, no one can stop him. He's just too big oh. and strong. It's cross court for McCall. Work off dead in the shoot. Exactly got away to fast starts this year. That's a fast start. A bucket in the first 14 seconds. That's just great. Away from the cup. Matthew turns it over. Tajima call in the Ooh. open court. Jordan's lead is 10. Four cans. Give a win number six. Put a crossover and glitter as McCall and off the glass and down. Pass to McVeigh who had no idea it was coming. Tajima called downhill. You can't stop him in that situation. Restricted to their seven primary guys. There's the transition that we're talking. Second block for Sam Wardenberg. And the pickpocket. McCall takes it away from Brown. Beautiful finish. Hope picks up the dribble. McCall goes to work, draws a foul, and gets it done as well. Chance at a three point play. Good feed from the call and more than single figures. Oh, they like this mismatch right here. McCall blows past Magna. <laughs> right decision. Only a couple of days ago. And it's when the Sydney Kings, where they get the message early about what they need to do on the defensive end, and that's not an ideal start. Turnover to start the second. Final 30 seconds of the opening quarter. McCall spins and one. That is a tough move.